bloody hooves. OK, George, why have you got that around your neck? They said I broke the toilet. Well, where is everybody? Kev's doing wheelies. <laughs> you mean burnouts? Burners. Hey, bro, make sure you get in the survive phone too. I want to send it to my dad. <laughs> Keith, yeah. there's something I need to bring to your attention. Well, Murray, can't it wait until I have a coffee? Well, that's just the thing, Keith. You know I went to a lot of effort to organise that new coffee machine and the charity chopper box. So what's the problem? Some asshole isn't paying up. Good morning, everyone. I'm Pete. Pete, um, George broke the lock on the toilet door. Tim, there's a problem with David. Oh, what's wrong with David? The little bastard's hung over. Look, he's spewed in me waste paper basket. Can't blow up a shit piece. Why to leave the door open then? Because George broke the lock, you little fucking midget. Piss off. I'm Amanda Doyle, the new regional manager of Swift and Shift. The courier business should be simple, really. You, the client, phones our call centre and tells us what's going where. The radio room should organise a competent driver to take your package from A to B on time. It seems so simple. So why does Keith's depot always manage to stuff it up? Hello, Swift and Shift courier. Hello? Amanda, it's Jonathan. Did you know that the insurance for Hashfield has gone up 40%? Why? Well, the insurance company now apparently gets access to the Department of Transport's records. Well, why does that change the insurance? Because those dickhead drivers at Hashfield have had so many licence cancellations, they're now considered high risk. Ergo, premiums go up. Hello, Swift and Shift couriers. Hold on. Keith, I've just got a customer complaint on line four. Well, where's bloody Renzo? Ah. Oh. Doreen made Renzo flash um, David's spew down the toilet. Come on, man! <laughs> Operations Manager Keith Warren speaking. Hello, look, I want to complain. I'm a nurse and I'm trying to get some bloody sleep. I've been working all night and two of your bands are hooning up and down. That's three to me out of best of five. That makes me the winner. And I think, what did we say was the prize? That's right, the losers had to say the winner was the king of street racing, didn't they? You're the king of street racing. No, 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 no. You've mumbled that like heaps. So I want to hear it loud and clear, mate. Come on. You're the king of street racing. Yes, mate, yes, I am the number one king of street racing. Suck on that, mate. Suck on that. Hey, hey Mario. Mario. Get fucked! <laughs> Pair off, big dead wankers! Uh, hello, Mario. Base free here. Yeah, what he is, Juan? Uh, Keith wants to know if you've been doing street racing. There's been a complaint, mate. Uh, no, nah, that, that, that couldn't have been me, man. Um, you must be mistaken me, probably with the twins. I think I've seen them doing some street racing before. Call them by. Oh, shit! Did I just get flashed? What are you doing? I'm counting coffee cups and chocolate wrappers because some dishonest asshole isn't paying their share. David, this is Bill here. I can't deliver this job, mate. Yeah, what's the problem? 
There's three wheelie bins out the front. I'm looking at there. It's heavy as lead. They're blocking the entrance. And I'm not supposed to move wheelie bins because it's not part of my job. Oh, man. Get your wife to do it. <laughs> uh, I've been told that you have to move the wheelie bins. That is not my job description. So it's your job to get out and do it. In other words, what you're just telling me now, you're nothing but a bludger in the car. Hello, Swift and Shift Couriers. Listen, it's Abdul. My radio is still not fixed, and I have to use my own personal phone. Did you know that? So what's the problem, Abdul? The problem is, yous are making me pick up bottles of kerosene. It's like petrol, and I'm using my phone. It's dangerous. How is that dangerous? This shit could blow up! Why you think you can't use mobiles in service stations, you stupid idiot? I want my radio fixed now! Hey! Yeah! Hey! Oh shit! Stop you, bitch! Oh, sorry, Keith, bro, but the toys are bold as. Kev, any more hoony around on the forklift and you're fired, understand? Oh, what? I don't know what you're talking about, Keith. Hey, George told me what you were doing outside, mate. This is your last warning. Now, clean that bloody mess up. George, clean that bloody mess up. Hi, Amanda, how are you? Keith, Jonathan's terribly upset about your couriers and their terrible driving records. Sorry, Amanda, what do you want about? The company's public liability insurance has gone through the roof thanks to your drivers, Keith. I've sent you an email with all the new staff rules and penalties regarding driving. Oh, and could you make sure that any courier on less than two points is fired today? Thank you. Winsor like a bitch, man. I've only got one point left on the license now. Let someone else take the bullet for you. You're a wonk, you got heaps of cousins anyway, don't you? That's a good idea, Smurf. You're little, but you got a big brain in that big head. Murray, I need you to find out which of our drivers has less than two points on their license and get right back to me. Keith, I'm a little busy with my investigation. Just do it, Murray. Hello, Amanda. Oh, yeah, hi, Sally. Look, you'll have to sign a stat deck for me uh, saying that you were driving my car this afternoon. I'm really, really sorry, but I can't. Well, why not? I don't have a licence anymore. Base one here, Soli. Uh, what's going on with your job to Regent's Park? Shit! No one is answering the door, presser, and now I'm inside the car park. So what are you going to do? You can just stand there. Hey! Hey, mate! Yeah, I think that's my bridge. Yeah, I'm up on the fifth floor. Alan, wait a second. Hey, which way is the lift escalator? Oh, the lift's fucked, mate. Y2K bug got it. Huh? Trapped my nan in there. She's still stuck in there. Fucking stinks, mate. Just come up and use the stairs. Can you help me? No, I can't. I've dumped me back in on the pogies. And I twisted my leg when I fell off the stool. Yeah, I've just got an eyelash caught in my eye too, so... Just bring her up, mate, and I'll be right. Chop, chop! Hurry up, matey! Wait, Jay! Ah! Ah! Oh, you stupid fucking idiot! What happened to your broken back and your broken leg? Huh? Oh, I was fucking bullshitting, so I didn't have to carry the fucking fridge up the fucking stairs. We think I'm a fucking idiot! Twins, come in. Murray here. I need to know how many points you have left on your licence. I think we've both got all our points. Would you have speed camera? <laughs> Fuck, that was lucky.
Hello, Operations Manager Damien Payne speaking. Damien, hi, it's Amanda. Damien, you're not using your licence in India, so um, how about you do me a big favour? Sure, Amanda, what do you need? Oh, your licence. Um, yeah, look, I, I'd love to help you out, I really would, but uh, my ex-girlfriend sort of amassed a large number of unpaid parking fines and there's been a bit of a dispute regarding their payment and, and, and they've cancelled my licence until it's resolved. Bro, what are you doing? Sorry, bro, look, we have to fix the lock. Otherwise, people could just walk in here when you're taking a shit. Let me just finish. Yeah, all right. Josh! 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 George, are you sure this is the right lock, bro? It's uh, bigger than the old lock, so it must be better. George! Hello, Swift and Shift. Hey, Melissa, it's me. Look, I've got to ask you something really important. Just, just hold on one second. Oh, uh, yeah, sorry about that. Um, yeah, look, I was thinking after work, if you need somebody to put, like, the spray on tan on you and do an even job, I could do it, cos I used to do spray painting. Mario, no. Hey, have you heard about the new driver's rules that are coming? Oh, ah! What rules? Any drivers with less than two points on their licence are getting the sack. What? Shit! Oh! It just came in from head office. Look, Melissa, if I give you 200 bucks, Will you do that thing where you take my points for me? If you said $500, I might be interested. Five? Make it four! Don't be a tight ass, Melissa, come on! OK, $400. Yeah! Okay. Don't get any ideas about me and you, all right? I'm only doing this so I can pay off my credit card. Ah, oh, fuck the hell! Base four to Jackie, come in. Base four to Jackie. Hello, I'm lost. I can't find my way out of this bloody car park. Drive towards the exit sign. Will you please to spell it? E-X-I-T. What? E-X-I-T. Well, you're double down, look. You're right, Jackie? Huh? I need to know how many points you've got left on your licence. i call you back later. I'm too busy because I'm lost. Get the terrorist on the radio, mate. I need to ask him about his license. Well, his radio's fucked. I'm gonna have to ring him on his mobile. And could you ask him about the six tracksuit tops that went missing yesterday? God, why are they ringing me for? What are they trying to do? Kill me? Hello? Ah! Abdul, what's going on? Stop it. Hey, bro, the toilet door's fixed. George did a good job. George! 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 Uh, uh, oh. Wake up, time to work! You might know! Fuck that, climbing first for all the headaches, debt, stress, problems. Whatever in the bottom of the bottle solves them. Oh. You think about giving it up? You might know! It's the hangover! It's the hangover! Ah. It's the hangover! Ah. Come on! Don't you fucking idiot! Hey, can you hear some thumping? Help me! It's probably the bloody air conditioning. Everything stuffs up around here. Man, I hate the hangover. See this crack set of God. Every reason these dudes can wank over. I drink till it's lights out. I'm a night out. My head hits the top of the top. I lose them by gal. Oh, it's the hangover. It's the hangover. Hmm, that's weird. I think that sound's just stopped.
Hello, Amanda? Melissa. Hi there. How would you like to get out of that zoo and back into sales? Oh, that'd be awesome. What do I have to do? I need some alcohol. I need some alcohol. I need some alcohol. Hey, Jesus, George, you scared the shit out of me. I fixed the toilet. Uh, where's Kevin JJ? They said I would have to wear the uh, toilet seat again if I told you. Oh, bro, can you believe that George the Clown dobbed us in? Bro, I was going to smash him. But then I thought, how can you damage your brain that's already been damaged? Kevin, if it was me getting back at someone that dobbed me in, I'd initiate Operation Desert Storm. What the fuck is that? What you do is, you get a leaf blower, right? You fill it with sawdust. Wait until the retard George is in the shit. Throw a bucket of water over him. Then under the door with the blower. And blast the fuck out of him with the sawdust. And that's Operation Desert Storm. OK, Agro, Kev, JJ. Get out of that bloody pub and get back to work. And I want you all to text Murray and tell him how many points you've got left on your licences. I'm Keith. I'm handling that now. Murray said he's busy with some kind of investigation. Oh, shit, is he still on about that? <laughs> OK, forget about Murray. Text Renzo instead, all right? About your licences. Let's go again. Yeah, bro. Sweetie. Three, please. Good on your girl. <laughs> Now, where's David? I think he's not back from the toilet yet. Oh, for Christ's sake, isn't anyone doing any work around here today? Anthony, go and find out what the bloody hell's taking David so long in the shit house. Sup, jump, why you speaking up? It's all front, we can see your bluff. How long do you think you can keep it up before the real recognise that you're weak? Sup, jump, why you speaking up? It's all front, we can see your bluff. Hello? Mario? Look, I can't, I can't sell you my points. Something's come up. Hey, have you seen David? No. Hey, hey, well, it's too late. It's all done. I just forged your signature on the forms at the motor registry. What do you mean you forged my signature? What? I did it all the time when we was living together. Look, uh, Melissa, I've got to go, but you've only got one point now left on your license. So, like, don't do any speeding, all right? Uh, I've got to go. <sighs> No stopping! Yeah, no stopping! I'm just going! Stopped! I'm going! You're talking on the telephone and that's no stopping! Who are you talking to? Your bum chum? Hey! Talk to your bum chum about this! Hey, Stooge! Yeah! Stooge Sorry, man, there's a high ticket danger today. I've got to put you out. Ticket alert! David! David! Did you fall in, bro? Far out. David! Wake up, bro! Dave! What are you doing? Just think of like shit in here. Dave! Uh. Hey! Don't sleep in the toilet. <sighs> Fucking get me out of here, man! Shit, bro, I think it's locked. How do we open it? What do you mean, how the fuck do you open it? Open the fucking door! I can't reach the lock, bro. Fucking climb over! These are my only work pants. I can't risk getting them ripped. Ah! Climb fucking over! Shit, I thought leprechauns were supposed to be friendly. Ah! Amanda Doyle, regional manager speaking. Amanda, it's Jonathan. I've got the list of high-risk drivers being CC'd to both of us. As soon as you get it, come to my office so we can discuss a new system for docking the bastards' wages. OK, Jonathan, I'll see you soon. Shit. <sighs> ah. Melissa. Amanda? Is it done? Look, there's just, um, there's just a minor problem with my licence. But, um, I was wondering, 
Is there anything else I could do to get back into sales? I gave you one chance to get it right. And you blew it, you useless bitch. You slut. Great. And now Melissa's not at her bloody desk. Keep your bloody shirt on, Keith. We're all working. Come on, fellas, hurry up. I haven't got all day for this. Come on. Just moving around here. Can you move across, mate? Everybody stop work. What the bloody hell's all this, Murray? I've finished my investigation regarding purchases from the coffee machine and chocolate box. I'm going to tally up my numbers in front of everyone. And then I'm going to expose the dishonest bastard or bitch who's been rotting the system. Hey, we're not even all here. What about the Maoris from the loading dock? <laughs> oh, Jesus. Um, what about George's spastic? Every time I see him, he's got a chocolate in his mouth. <laughs> oh, sweet, bro. George has gone upstairs for his afternoon ship. <laughs> Lock and load, cosy. Yeah, and what about David and Anthony? <laughs> Look, Damien, I don't have time for any bullshit, OK? So how about you just tell me how this is supposed to happen? Well, it occurred to me, if we can't exploit migrant workers, who can we exploit? Let's face it. With all the drivers we have over there, we need to treat them as a resource. Look, I've got him on the other line. Hang on, Amanda. OK. Hello, Kashif. Is it done? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all done. All too easy, as they say here. Yeah, right. Will this affect my license in India? Uh, Kashif, no, I, I, I don't know. Because I'm a virgin, you know. Oh, really? Yeah. This could affect my whole family's reputation. Yeah, right. Okay. I'm still a virgin, you know. Yeah, yeah, whatever, Kashif. Hello, Amanda. It's done. Um, look, Damien, that's great work. Um, I'm just going in for a meeting with Jonathan. Thank you. Okay, oh, everybody yes. back to work, all right? Keith, fuck, how could you? Oh, look, it's all a misunderstanding. A misunderstanding. I asked Anthony to take my share out of petty cash, but it was always my intention to uh, eventually repay the money to petty cash at a later date. Where is that bastard Anthony anyway? I'm disappointed, Keith. <laughs> Over all right, all right, all right. Give me a boost and watch the pants. Amanda, I've just been looking at this list of high-risk drivers and your name's on it. There is a glitch in that system. Uh, I've been on the phone all morning trying to sort it out and it's all fine and... Um... Amanda, don't bullshit me. These new rules aren't going to apply to you. You're senior management. Hmm. If you rack up heaps of fines and points, just do what I do. Well, what's that? I use my nephew George's licence. He can't drive, he's disabled. I made him get a licence for situations just like this. I can even fake his signature. Oh. Ah. Stay still. Oh, come on, man. You're all right. Ah. You're kind of like a stepladder, bro. Fuck it out. There he is. You come to stay humongous head. <laughs> Cowboy. 